How's it going, you guys? New Age here with our live showdown battles using our gym leader team. So it's Redemption Week right on here. And actually, I forgot to change. Let's see if I could change the avatar. And it's supposed to be Coca. What are you doing, Erica? There you go. Don't know if it'll change mid battle, but you know what? Either way. Anyways, uh, if you might recognize this team, this is a, a subscriber viewer. We battled him last week. Uh, with Lieutenant Surge's team, and he said he was interested. Sorry, screen's not even right. He said he was interested in a rematch, so went ahead and uh, allowed that to happen. So he's bringing the same team as last time: Charizard, Zapdos, Espeon, uh, Mamoswine, Rotom Wash, and the Jirachi. And. See, people don't know it's Koga. If I don't change, if I don't change it, so I'm gonna go ahead and lead off with Ariados. Like is the plan of the team. Sorry that Koga's not right there. I'll change it before we do the next battle. Well, I actually did change it, but I'll make sure it's changed because I do two battles. He did say he only wanted to do one battle, so this is the battle uh, that we're that we're gonna be doing here. He's battling against Koga's team, so we'll see how this goes. So he's starting off with the Mammoth Swine, and that's a, obviously a good choice on his part. Uh... I mean, I'll just go for the... Oh wait, no. That's right, he has an Espeon. I'm gonna go for Exeter, predicting him to switch into the Espeon. If I don't get the Sticky Web or Poison Spikes, talk to Spikes up, it's not that big of a deal. Because most of his Pokemon are flying anyway, so... Really, it's not that big. And if I get it out on a... There we go. If I get it off on Espeon, it's going to work out nice and well. Alright, so uh, we got the uh, X Scissor off on him. Uh, I'm just going to go for another X Scissor because I don't know if he has a status move or anything for me to go for Sucker Punch, and I it can't kill me anyways because I'm Focus Sashed. So, yeah, kind of just going to give up on the Aerito setting up the Sticky Web because one of his Pokemon that's already affected by it anyways is already dead. So, <clears throat> granted, slowing down the Mamoswine would be great. Don't really think I'm going to get that opportunity. I also... Toxic Probe doesn't really have anything for Charizard or, uh... Well, it does for Zapdos or Ice Punch. I would love to get rid of, uh... I would love to get rid of Charizard if I could. <laughs> Just don't know how I'm going to go about doing that. So I'm going to go for Sucker Punch, see if I can get an attack off. Uh, if not, that's okay. You could just go for the Ice Shard, I'm sure he outspeeds me. And that'll take me out. So now, great Pokemon to go into would be Weezing, because uh, I can trap him in here if I need to, if he decides to stay in. Uh, he also doesn't really have anything. Other than Rodham, I guess. So I'm gonna go for Infestation, see if he stays in. I honestly don't think he will. I don't see any point for him to stay in. Uh, he can't hit me with ground, and he can try and hit me with ice, but... I'm fully defensive, so... Would not be in his best bet. If anything, maybe him go out into Jirachi, but Rodham... Yeah, Rodham, I would think, would be the main Pokemon to go out into here. So, let's see. I mean, I kind of want to see what I could do with this guy, even though my special defense is not that great. I also don't want him to burn me. I'm going to go for a Will-O-Wisp. Uh, he misses his! Damn it, and I missed mine too. Well, that was just lovely. <laughs> Getting the extra damage off on him along with the uh, infestation will be good to wear Rodham down. Uh, he has leftovers, so he probably doesn't have rest. Uh, also, I may be able to outstar him. Granted, he might go for Volt Switch. I'm actually going to go into Needle King. If he goes for the Hydro Pump, that'll be bad. But if he goes for the Volt Switch, it's not going to hurt me. Uh, and also, I kind of need Needle King for Jirachi. But I'm kind of trying to play it a little risky right here. Not for any reason, just want to try it out. Oh, he went for the Hydro Pump. Uh, also, didn't say this, episode 62, current record, 29 wins, 39 losses. So, let's see here. 
I think this may be a great time to set up a Scolipede, actually. While we have kind of like a stally Pokemon out here. I'm gonna do that. Uh, I want to go for Protect just to see what he's gonna do. But then again, if he switches into Charizard next turn, that's kind of gonna screw me over. So I'm gonna go for a Swords Dance first. If he wants to burn me, that's fine. I'm not trying to sweep a Solipede. And Baton Pass does not pass burn, so... Oh, and he misses again. Not half bad. And honestly, if I get my attack high enough, uh, I might just try and kill the Rotom. I don't know if I should go for Protect here or not. I want to go for another Sword Stance, but if he burns me, uh, I'm not going to kill the Rotom with the Megahorn. I really want to see how much Megahorn would do. I'm going to go for Megahorn. Mm! There you go, took out the Rotom. Not bad. And got the free speed boost. Bad news is, if he goes into Charizard, I can't really Baton Pass uh, Toxic Croak into that. I really should have thought of that first. Because I don't have anything boosting its defense. Okay, he didn't go out to Charizard, which is actually really good. So I'm gonna get the Protect off just to see what he's trying to do. So he goes for Zen Headbutt. Ugh. Yeah, there's a lot of Pokemon I actually need to get rid of before I can even think about switching out. Let's see how much a Megahorn does. Please hit it, Scolipede. Mm. Oh, that was bad. Oh, he misses too. So I got the speed up again. I'm gonna go for it again. I, I need to see how much this does if it hits. Oof, not enough to kill. Oh my gosh, he just missed too. <laughs> Dang. Well, I can kill Drachi. Bad news is, I don't think I'm getting to set up uh, Toxic Croak. But if I can take out this Drachi, that'd be amazing. I would love the Baton Path, but I can't. I can't now, I just realized. If I can get rid of Charizard, I should be able to. I'll have to see what happens. So I went into Zapdos. Honestly, I think that's better off for me. I don't think he could kill me in one shot, so I'm gonna go for a sword stance and then baton pass. Oh! I forgot Zapdos gets heat wave. That just completely screwed me over. Alright, well, I've got the assault vet to Dragalge. <clears throat> I should be alright, honestly. I'm gonna go for that sludge bomb. See how much damage I can do. I should be fine. I really hope I'm fine. Dragology's base special defense is pretty damn high. And if I could poison this thing, that'd be fantastic. Good news, if I get him down to just Mamoswine, Weezing can beat that. Bad news, don't really know what I'm gonna do about Charizard. Weezing can't burn Charizard, and I'm already burned. So he could wear me down, I'm sure, pretty bad. Oh, he went into Mamoswine. Uh, well, I'm just gonna go back into Weezing. <laughs> gonna go back into Weezing, then use Infestation. Uh, whatever I can trap, I'm kinda cool with that, I guess. Even though Zapdos will probably take me out. I feel like Toxic Croak to beat it, too. He has a lot of stuff that's actually good against Poison on his team. Ronim is good just because it's a good special attacker. Uh, Jirachi was good, Poison, or Steel and Psychic, that's amazing. And then, uh, Espeon was good. It just ended up dying too fast. And then Char Charizard X is good. Wow, he was fat. Oh, well, yeah, he's faster. Duh. Well, that sucks. Uh. Weezing, you're, you're completely invested in defense. I figure you would do a lot better than that. Is he gonna switch out? Is that a, is that a thing? Is he choice? What did he use on me before? 
No, he's not choice, because he just... He might be choice. No, he only used Icicle. Ice Shard. If he switches out... I might go for Ice Punch. Unless he's trying to stay in and hit me with Icicle Crash. I'm gonna go for Ice Punch. Play it risky. I've been playing it risky. It hasn't paid off. Oh, Zapdos? Yes. Woo! Not bad on the damage right there. So, uh, I am dry skinned, so... Yeah. So, that, uh... That heat wave is gonna hurt. I'm gonna go for a Sucker Punch, even though he can go for Roost. I really hope he doesn't go for Roost. Oh, it didn't kill! Well, it didn't kill me either, but... I mean, hey, that kinda sucks. So, Bullet Punch should take it out. What?! Okay, I'm sad. I lost. <laughs> that is horrible. To think I relied on a toxic croak to sweep for me. That, that is so bad. <clears throat> so, uh, of course I'm gonna take that like a champ, but of course I'm also gonna get burned. So, then he can go out into his Mount of Swine and finish me up with Earthquake. He's faster than me, he's choiced, so, uh, I don't know if he's banded or scarfed, but either way he's faster than me. And either way, uh, that'll finish me up. So, I'm gonna go for a skull to see if I can get a burn. That would. Actually, I can't burn it. I'm stupid. Well, do I have anything else? Should I just go for Sludge Bomb then? I think I'll just go for Sludge Bomb if it lets me switch. Showdown is weird about letting you switch what moves you just used. Oh, hey, Dragon Claw Kill. Oh, that. Pfft, that's right. Turns into a dragon. Forgot it was Charizard X. that so I am Koga now so now we got one more battle so that brought our record to uh, 20 no 30 30 wins we didn't win 29 wins 37 losses so we're gonna try and get one last battle going and see how this works yeah I kind of forgot that uh, using the Tom Hats you have to switch into a move I really should have thought about that sooner and we got another Mammoth Swine and the Victini which wow that's horrible and a meta challenge, which kinda not worried about. <clears throat> Good news is, there's a lot more that uh, wants to get sticky webbed, so that's nice. So, uh, yeah, slowing down will be good. Go ahead and go with that. So he goes for U turn, uh, Mammoth Swine? Mammoth Swine? Oh, okay. I mean, I'm cool with that, because then I get Toxic Spikes. So he went for Leech Seed, uh, I'm honestly not even going to try and hit this thing. But, let's see, what do I have? Hmm. No, I kind of want to save Needle King. I kind of want to go out into Skullipede and try and get that set up. But I would have to do it before he switched back out into a uh, Victini. Wow, that was a lot of damage. And I can only get faster. Holy crap. So I lost 61%, so regardless, I'm not getting that back. <clears throat> I might. I don't know what else I would go into. Because, wow, that was horrible. That was some bad damage. I might just go in back into uh, Eridos. 
and then get a safe switch into something else. Because I'm not leaving Skullipede in to die like that. You can kill Ariados. I'm okay with that. Hey, look at that speed. Mmm. That actually did some nice damage. I'm surprised. So we have for Curse, which, uh... I mean, okay. I do have Focus Blast with your Galaxy. I guess if I want to risk hitting that... Sure. I'll assume we go into Metacham afterwards, I guess. I mean, let's try! Hey, we missed. What else is new? Alright. So now he knows what I'm gonna do. He doesn't switch out, so that's cool. Uh, it also doesn't kill, but I die. Wow, Koga. You are doing a lot worse than you were doing before. I was gonna go into Needle King. The only reason I didn't want to do it is because it's extremely obvious that I would use Flamethrower. So honestly, he's probably gonna switch out. I wonder if I can, like, go for Earth's power. Oh, well, he stayed in. Okay. So, Ron and Mo, uh, I'm cool with that. Flamethrower, Ice Beam, Flamethrower, Ice Beam. Uh, I think Flamethrower hits more of his Pokemon. I'm gonna go for that. I don't know what Rodham wants to do to me. Trick me, maybe? I can see that being a thing. Why would he Volt Switch me? I don't know what he was doing there. I'm obviously not gonna, like, stay in. Or switch out. There you go. When I could just kind of one-shot him. Okay, so the match was forfeited. Uh, I don't know if I was going to win that one. He was kind of making some bad moves. I know for a fact I'm going to lose this one, though. Latios is good against me. Uh, Gyarados, but as Earthquake is, Landorus. Mamoswine. Arcanine, I can't burn. And Shroomish, or Breloom, is just asking to be poisoned. So, uh, let's see what kind of fun shenanigans we can have with this. Three of us Pokemon are affected by Sticky Web. And Toxic Spikes is kind of just a joke for me to use, honestly. I'm just going to get the Sticky Web off, see what I can do. And uh, he can defog if he really wants to. <clears throat> oh, he wants to for Stealth Rocks. Okay. I'm just going to go for x I don't care if he kills me. There wouldn't be much I could do for hitting him anyways. So I'm sure he's going into Latios right now to defog, and Psychic is good against my whole damn team. Oh, he went into Braylon. I mean, okay. Uh, don't I have something that can't... Oh yeah, Ariados can't be put to sleep. <laughs> oh, that's funny. But everything else can be put to sleep. I'm gonna go out and scope you. <laughs> I mean, if I can get some stuff going, I don't want to use protect just to see what he's going for. Oh, it's Stone Edge. Okay. I mean, that's cool. So I am going to go ahead and baton pass because no way I'm dealing with that. Granted, don't even think Nido King wants to take a Stone Edge like that either. I also kind of want to save Needle King if I can. Actually, you know, with the speed boost, it might be good to just throw it out there now. Granted, he'll be taking a Stone Edge to the face. We did take that pretty well. So, I'm going to go for Ice Beam. I think that hits more of his team. As opposed to going for Flamethrower. And we'll see how much it does. And he's Focus Sash, so what's he going for? Oh, Spore, he's putting me to sleep. Cool. Alright, uh, I'm not going to stop going for Ice Beam, honestly. I mean, at this point, I kind of, I'm, I'm just going to leave it out. I really hope it wakes up, because nothing else on his team, well, no, Metal Swine has priority. I don't know what I'm talking about. I am not a smart fella, 
right now. So Nido King's gonna go down, which you know what? I mean that's that's a thing. That's the thing that happens. Can I like switch into Weezing so I can't be put to sleep again? Nope. Did not let me cancel that one. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go back out into Skullipede. <coughs> uh, should be faster. I'm gonna try and just use like Megahorn on this thing or something. Hey, there you go. So we beat one of his Pokemon, and that's honestly probably all we're gonna beat. <laughs> Who knew there were so many ground Pokemon out there that people use on every single one of their teams? Like, whoa. So we got Arcanine here to get the uh, Intimidate off. Which I obviously don't want to pass that on. But uh, what I may be interested in passing on is uh, a speed boosted Weezing? What? Maybe. I mean, let's see some defenses right here 216. 339, oh yeah. I'm sure I'll definitely take uh, that a lot better. Weezing is faster than Dracology, dang. That is kind of really sad for real. So I want a baton pass into Weezing. If I could get Arcanine stuck in here, that'd be nice, because that's just the thing I want to do. Wow, all these Pokemon doing so much damage that I wouldn't expect them to do. Let's go for Infestation. I can pop the Air Balloon. Maybe. Maybe I'll switch out. I don't know. <clears throat> I think Weezing is so defensive and yet it's just getting completely overpowered. It's invested max HP, max defense too. So he can take me out next turn with a uh, Flare Blitz, I'm pretty sure. Loses 38. Oh, so I just barely make it. Let's try Pants Split, I guess. Mmm, not bad. Kinda wish I had Protect on here now. That would have been a cool thing to have. A nifty thing to have. Part of me wants to switch into Dragalchi. Mmm. Sure. Sure. Let's switch into Dragology to take this Flare Blitz. Heh, <laughs> got you poisoned. That's not bad. That's what Dragology's ability is for. Koga, man, not doing so well. It's kind of making me rethink Sabrina, Steve, now. <clears throat> Let's see tomorrow. I went for a more bulky approach, which that's not gonna... Now I'm thinking it won't work. And uh, this situation I'm in won't work. He's gonna go for an Ice Type move because Ice Type will kill Dragalge, and I can't switch into Weezing because that'll probably kill Weezing too. Scald, get the burn. Oh, it survived. Oh, please burn it, please burn it, please burn it. Thank you. Thank you. Well, that was a beautiful display of burning Dragalge. Gotta admit. Hmm. I should be fine to go into Weezing now. Maybe get a little extra health. I don't know. 23%, 21%. Yeah, there's not really any point. I feel like I'll actually lose health. Give me that leftovers. That's gonna do nothing. Maybe I can magically survive a hit. Actually, he still has Latios. I'm gonna die. Oh, if only I could burn this Gyarados, that would be beautiful. I don't know why I went for Will-O-Wisp and I should have went for Pan Split, but, you know. Not that it matters, I kind of died. So, part of me wants to go for Sword Stance, thinking he'll just go for Dragon Dance. Let's try it. Hey, look at that. He did. He did it. 
Maybe he'll attack me now. Who knows? Is there still hope? Ice Punch will kill Landius and uh, Landorus if I can happen to make that work. Actually, if he's going for the ground move trying to hit uh, Toxicroak, that would be amazing because I have Air Balloon for that exact reason. Alright. <sighs> Let's do it. Let's hope I can make this work. Somehow. Go for the Earthquake. <laughs> you know you want to. Sup. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not bad. I know I'm faster than Latios, uh, don't really know how I'm killing Gyarados. Actually, Gyarados will have to pawn my air balloon, meaning if he only has Waterfall and Earthquake, uh, he's kind of screwed. <laughs> Not that I really even think it matters, I already lost my attack boost. Sucker Punch does the most. Let's try that. Oh, he's Mega Gyarados. Oh, I knew I should have went. Please use Waterfall. Thank you. What? Oh, Mold Breaker! That's the thing! That's right! Oh no, now I'm screwed. Huh. Mold Breaker. Whoa. Hey! <laughs> Is this gonna be a thing that happens? Like, can I... Can I do this? Don't, don't... Don't play with me now. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Me and this dude are spazzing out right now. The comeback is real. Aw, <laughs> uh, he left. I wanted to invite him to my channel. Well, uh, dang. The 30 wins. 37 losses. That's going to be our record now. And, wow. <laughs> that was insane. That was insane. <laughs> That comeback was so real. I'm sorry about what I said, Toxicroak, in the last battle. I'm sorry. You pulled through like no other. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. So if you guys enjoyed my amazing comeback, go ahead and leave a like right there. Uh, oh, he's still here. Uh, if you want to see more, you can subscribe to my channel, New Age where I upload multiple videos every single day. And you can also follow me on Instagram and Twitter, where I post hand first hand information on when I upload videos to the channel. So until then, I'm new still keep on watching. I know I didn't say all the intro, but I'm talking to this guy. So I'll see you guys next time.